Welcome back. A family in Thika is mourning the death of their 25-year-old kin who died inside a boiler at a steel in a manufacturing factory in the area. It is reported that Caleb Oteno met his death when his glove got stuck to a metal he was feeding to the boiler machine. The family of Kale Boteno has been thrown into mourning after their kin was liquefied in a boiler at the steel manufacturing factory he was working at. The deceased's brother, John Agwambo, explained that Caleb, who had worked at the company for seven years, was trying to detach his glove from a piece of metal when he was sucked into the high-temperature boiler where he died. He bemoaned that the family will not have a body to bury following the incident. Uh, I'm a bad accident na kakufa. Kufatilia zaidi, tukambiwa alikuwa nafanya kwa boiler. Tunapea information kuwa ni kama aliteleza, akaingia kwa boiler. Mwili ya yezi patikana, tunambiwa temperature ya pale, inakuanga very high. So mwili already mesiagwa, imeisha. So there is nothing we can get. Tumejaribu kuongea now, if the, we can get even just a single part of the body, so that we may prepare burial process. Wakatuambia for now, nothing can be, we can get nothing. He says the accident could have been avoided. Tumeenda pale, tumeona ni area very dangerous. First thing, you wanafanya ju. Na chini ni kama boiler, wanachukua chuma wakirusha. That process, kwa hiyo process, ndi udugu yangu ambaya naitua Caleb, aliteleza na meishia pale. Michael Arao, a family friend who visited the facility after the tragic accident, took issue with the management of the factory for failing to communicate the accident to the family and called for authorities to take action to prevent similar incidences in the future. Apoteza kijana hata tuja patua abari any family member a company awaja waeleza hata wajapopigia tumepigia tu na rafiki ambao walikuwa wanafanya naye so tuseme ni kama kama huyo kama angepiga na mtu pia huwezi ukaona si angepotea tu hivyo the facility has been shut down till monday to allow for investigations for lunchtime news heritage kiprano